Maybe our life is already mapped out for us without us even knowing. Maybe we are supposed to meet other people before we meet the one. So when that person finally arrives, we are truly grateful for the gift we have been given. Maybe it's true that we don't know what we've lost until we lose it. But it's also true that we don't know what we're missing until it arrives. Maybe once in a lifetime you find someone who not only touches your heart, but also your soul. Someone who loves you for who you are and not for what you could be. Maybe the art of true love is not about finding the perfect person, but about seeing the imperfect person perfectly. Ladies and gentlemen, it is great to see you all here today and to witness Sarah and Paul's marriage and the merging of these two families. We are glad that you have found love together and today is a reminder that the best is yet to come. So I'd like to turn everybody's attention to my gorgeous Mrs. Harling sitting next to me. I'm sure you'll all agree that Sarah looks absolutely amazing and I'm definitely the luckiest man to call you my wife. And you will love Sarah because she gives me that exact feeling when you see food coming out of the restaurant. <laughs> so that feeling of total anticipation and excitement. That's how she makes us feel every time I say her or every time she walks into a room. Do you, Paul, take Sarah here present to be your lawful wedded wife, to be loving, loyal and faithful to her for the rest of your lives together? I do. And do you, Sarah, take Paul here present to be your lawful wedded husband, to be loving, loyal and faithful to him for the rest of your lives together? From this day forward, I promise to share my life with you, to laugh with you, to be proud of you, never to take you for granted, and always take care of you. I will be faithful to you, and I promise to love you for the rest of my life. I promise to give you my love and friendship, to be there for you when you need me the most, to laugh with you, to cry with you, to confide and trust in you, to comfort and support you, to share all that I have with you to respect you and to be faithful always. These promises I make to you for the rest of my life. It therefore gives me great pleasure to declare you are now united as husband and wife. And you, sir, may kiss your beautiful bride. <laughs> Sarah, you're an amazing person, inside and out, and I appreciate everything you do for me and the family on a daily basis. So, I'm going to make this promise to you now in front of all of our family and friends. Um, I will love you until the day I die, and I will never stop telling you how perfect you are. So I love you lords. Please stand and toast my stunning bride, Sarah Ann Harling. <laughs> person who I've met that is uh, just as kind-hearted as his is Sarah. 
I adore her with all my heart and I'm so glad that she's came into my life um, when she did. I don't know what I did without her and I'm so glad that you have both found happiness within each other um, as I don't know anyone who deserves it more than you both. <laughs>